Since 2016, Overwatch has had one of the highest rates of female engagement of any online FPS game. And that is something we were very proud of. Together, we conquered battlefields and destroyed entire armies. But then, something happened. Our female gamers began to face increased sexual harassment and sexism from male comrades. Let me have your Snapchat. Grill, can I have your Snapchat? Wait, what's your real Snapchat? Jesus time? Christ, thanks for the fucking gamer girl. As women began to report these toxic players, our moderators stepped up their game to process all reports as fast as possible. But we faced a hurdle all games deal with. Vocal harassment is very hard to verify. We didn't address this issue fast enough, and to our deep regret, we saw many female players quit Overwatch altogether. But don't worry, loves! In 2020, you better believe we're bringing back our female warriors with our new release of Overwatch 2. Overwatch 2 introduces Tag of Shame. When a player vocally harasses another player, our AI, a combination of voice recognition and gameplay monitoring, will detect the malicious words instantly. From that point onward, their profile pictures will change to mugshots with types of crimes they have committed to reveal their true identities. Additionally, the electronic anklets will be attached to the offenders' characters, which allow the opposing teams to monitor these toxic players literally everywhere at any time. From Hollywood to Nepal, with one solution, we discourage anyone from behaving like a dick on our platform and also create a safer environment for all players. Cheers, love! The cavalry's here!